Hey guys, so today I figured out how to connect my Apple Vision Pro with my Mac Pro 5 comma 1 doing the screen sharing thing. Normally you would need a new Mac and Sonoma running, but I'm running Monterey on my Mac Pro 5 comma 1. And I'm using an iPad app, and this app's been around for a long time, that's why I decided to give it a shot, called Splash Top. Link in the description. And sure enough, it works really well. You can see I've got Pro Tools open. I'm playing back a tune and I'm able to play the Pro Tools audio or any audio that's playing on my Mac into the Apple Vision Pro speakers. In Pro Tools, you go to the playback engine and select Splash Top. And when you're using Apple software to do the screen sharing of your Mac to your Apple Vision Pro, albeit it's in 4K, this is in 1080, you can't get the audio coming into the Apple Vision Pro. You have to either use your AirPods or have it playing out of the speakers of your Mac. So there you can see I got Pro Tools open. Right behind me is my mirrored screen. And the other thing that's cool is I have three monitors. I can look at any of those three monitors one at a time. And as you can see, I just moved Final Cut Pro from my main monitor, the real monitor, over to my second monitor. And now I'm switching my virtual monitor up above. And you can see that I'm now looking at the mirrored image of my second monitor. So I can switch between any of my three monitors and be able to see it on Apple Vision Pro. Now keep in mind, this is streaming. There is quite a bit of lag. The audio quality is set to medium and that's as high as it'll go unless you start paying for it and then I guess that gets improved. But this is free. And you can use the keyboard and mouse connected to your Mac or you can use the Apple Vision Pro gestures or both. But here I am mousing around using what they have in the software as the trackpad. You sort of get like a trackpad functionality and I'm just moving my fingers around in the air to do this. So now I'm going to launch Final Cut Pro. It's going to pop open in a minute. It's launching on the Mac Pro 5 comma 1. There it is. And uh, open up a project. There we go. And I can go in there. I can do some edits, I can export a movie, you know, I can do whatever I want to do in Final Cut. So it's pretty darn cool that you can do this with an old Mac and the Apple Vision Pro. So I know that it doesn't look very good in this video, but it's just a screen capture at 720p and it actually looks really good and everything is totally readable. It's a little bit fuzzy, but it's totally usable. It's not going to be as good as Apple's own direct to a new Mac 4K version, like I said, but you can access any of your Macs on your network if you're running Splashtop on them, and you can even access them over the internet if you set that up. I think that's a paid subscription. But this is the free version and it works really well. And even if you have a newer Mac, you can probably still also connect to an older Mac with this at the same time that you're connecting to the new Mac because it's using a different software to do it. So that's pretty cool. And you can see I got YouTube open and the audio is streaming into the Apple Vision Pro. And it's spatial audio, so as I move my head around the direction where the audio is coming from, it seems like the audio is coming out of the virtual screen. So you might think that's playing on my 48 inch monitor, but no. It's the virtual monitor and I just made it way bigger than my 48 inch OLED. So yeah, Splash Top is a great little app. It's been around for a long time, but now you can use it with your Apple Vision Pro. And this is the first app I've tried that does screen sharing like this. There are a lot of other ones, so there might be a better one out there, but so far this one has worked for me and it's free. And on a totally different note, check out this game Jetpack Joyride. It's just an iPad game, but Look at the 3D environment, total immersion you get when you play it on Apple Vision Pro. You can just look in any direction and you're immersed. And it's very cool. You have all these little things that you can click on and interact with, like this little robot over here and the telephone and these robots floating around. It's so 3D, it's really cool. And on that note, thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. I'll be doing some more Apple Vision Pro stuff in the near future. And I'll see you on the next Max Sound Solutions video.